In the United States alone, someone has a heart attack every 40 seconds. That's 805,000 people per year experiencing their first or recurring heart attack. One in five heart attacks are silent, but they can cause significant damage that increases the risk of mortality. A heart attack is often the result of extended symptoms, including blood pressure, high cholesterol levels, stress and a sedentary lifestyle, or developing chronic diseases. So while a heart attack might feel sudden, experts have found that the body does give you warning signs up to a month before a heart attack occurs. So what are the signs you should be wary of if you want to prevent a heart attack? Don't go anywhere and keep watching. In this video, we'll share the three common warning signs that can arise a month before a heart attack. What you'll discover will shock you. But before we get started, can you do us a favor and like this video? ring the bell for future notifications, and make sure you subscribe to Heart Disease Code for more help managing your blood health. And stick around to find out how you can get two free gifts. And now, let's take a look at the warning signs your body gives you a month before a heart attack, starting with number three, pain in the chest, shoulder and neck. While pressure in the chest is a common sign associated with a heart attack, if you experience sudden and irregular pain in your shoulder, jaw or neck, you might want to speak with a doctor. Pain in the chest, shoulder, jaw and neck can be a sign of damaged heart tissue. As the arteries are clogged, they send pain signals down the spinal cord, which pinch nerves connected to the shoulders, neck and jaw. As a result, the pain can feel sudden, sharp, dull or irregular, like a pulled muscle. Pain in the shoulder and neck are symptoms that doctors and scientists started to focus on only recently. However, these symptoms have also been strongly linked with cervical artery dissection, a strong precursor of strokes. In one study, 67% of patients reported signs of cervical artery dissection a month prior to having a stroke. The, and emerging research is pointing out that it could be the same for heart attacks. These symptoms can be seen as the result of angina or heartburn. Researchers pointed out that recurring complications of angina can lead to a heart attack. So if you're starting to experience pain in the neck, jaw, shoulder and chest, along with other symptoms, it's best to go speak with your doctor to prevent a potential heart attack. Number two, prolonged fatigue and dizziness. Fatigue and dizziness may be the result of many things. However, when paired with other symptoms, it can also be a sign of an upcoming heart attack. Feeling unexplained and prolonged fatigue can come suddenly and last days or even weeks. Typically, prolonged fatigue will also come with other symptoms such as dizziness, insomnia, heavy sensation around the body and legs and brain fog. At first, you might link these symptoms to exhaustion or the flu. However, feeling fatigued for a prolonged period of time is the warning sign that this symptom may be linked to your heart. Women in particular are more likely to experience prolonged fatigue as a precursor sign of heart attack. A study done by the American Heart Association recruited 515 women in their 60s who were discharged after a heart attack. After assessing the symptoms they had experienced prior to a heart attack, the study observed that 70% of women reported prolonged fatigue in the months leading to their heart attack, while only 30% reported chest pain as a precursor symptom. Pretty shocking, right? This suggests that symptoms of heart attack can be significantly different between men and women. Additionally, women are more likely to assume fatigue and dizziness are linked to vertigo and menopause. So if you're experiencing these symptoms, do not dismiss them and speak with a doctor. It can be a sign that a heart attack is coming. Along with unusual pain and prolonged fatigue, there is one more warning sign that can show up a month before a heart attack. But before you find out what it is, are you ready for two free gifts? Find out everything you need to know to prevent heart disease with our free ebook, The Surprising Truth About Fat and Cholesterol. Plus, get exclusive insights from some of the world's leading medical and nutritional professionals by watching the first episode of The Untold Story of Heart Disease. 
Both gifts can be grabbed simply by clicking the link in the description below, so go and claim them for free. And now, let's look at another warning sign your body gives you a month before a heart attack, with number one, shortness of breath and signs of panic attack. When you struggle to breathe, experience heart palpitation and a little anxiety, it's easy to assume that you're having a panic attack. However, it can also be your body warning you of a potential heart attack. Signs of panic attack, including shortness of breath, means that little oxygen is circulating in your blood and getting to your heart. That is why you may experience heartbeat acceleration and arrhythmia. But what is worrying about these symptoms is that they can also lead to dizziness, prolonged fatigue and chest pain. In fact, shortness of breath is one of the most prevalent signs of coronary artery disease. A cohort study observed that 40% of women diagnosed with a heart condition reported shortness of breath and palpitation up to six months before having a heart attack. Men diagnosed with coronary artery disease are also likely to experience similar symptoms. Overall, one symptom can indicate many health issues. However, when these symptoms are paired together, and experienced regularly or spontaneously over the course of a month, it's a sign that your body is actively trying to communicate with you, that a heart attack is coming. So if you notice one or more of these symptoms, take it with seriousness and go speak with a doctor. Now we want to hear from you. Are you surprised to find out that these symptoms can actually predict a heart attack? Share your thoughts with the Heart Disease Code community in the comments. And before you leave, Make sure to claim your free gifts by clicking the link in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe to our Heart Disease Code channel and hit that bell button for more help managing your blood health. Thanks for watching.